Up for the latest and greatest uh, gizmos, and I think he's got another one. Now, this week, Mike, you have the HD Pocket Camcorder. Yeah, camcorders have been getting smaller and smaller, and even the HD ones, they started out fairly large, but they're really tiny. These ones are made by a company called Flip, and they actually come out today in Canada. Yeah, so we have them here. We have them here. First and foremost, all right, you tested them out. They're resilient little yeah, things. Exactly. We've knocked them around, <laughs> trust me. Uh, so you tested this out on a family? Yep. Okay, let's have a look. When you're three months old, life is full of firsts. There's your first smile, first steps, your first game of Hungry Hungry Hippos. Life is all about discovery. Thankfully, Mom is there to capture it all on tape. I'm fanatical about it. I have to. Everything. Everything they do, everything that they're not doing, I'm always taking pictures of. And if it's not photos, it's video. Kara Dieters always has her camcorder out. Her parents love watching videos of their grandchildren. But they don't get to see them as often as they'd like. They're always, send video of the kids, send video of the kids, and I just find it way too hard, way too hard to do. Flip is releasing a camcorder to try and solve that very problem, the Flip Ultra HD. This tiny video camera shoots 30 frames per second in 720p high definition. Yet it's built small enough to take anywhere to quickly capture those memorable moments life throws your way. This is my Zooey family. We gave the Flip Ultra HD to the Dieters so they could be one of the very first Canadian families to try it out for themselves. If you were to describe the Ultra HD in one word, it would have to be simple. You can pick up this camera and begin shooting without even reading a manual. What is there? Five buttons on here? Power, record, stop, play, and delete? Doesn't get much simpler than that. The camera is designed for one-handed operation. Your thumb controls everything from recording to zooming. The lens is fixed focus, giving you two times optical zoom. And the action is viewed through a two-inch LCD screen. It's super, super clear. Even being outside, it's really sunny out, but it's not, um, it's not distorted in any way. It's a very clear picture. Despite its small size, you can squeeze up to two hours worth of HD video onto the built-in memory. So the Dieters family have shot about 20 minutes of video on the Flip Ultra HD. Time to see the results. The camera hooks up to your computer through the built-in USB connection. Install some software and your videos pop up within seconds. Hey, then look at mom. Hi! Pump your legs. She's really clear. It's great. For such a small camera, the video quality is surprisingly good. And the built-in software gives you plenty of options on what to do with it. You can edit video, email it, upload your videos to YouTube, or create your own music videos. The best part about the software is how easy it is to create your projects. Seconds step as fast, which is great for me because I don't have time. I don't have time to be out of the room away from the kids. But Kara's husband caught a few things his wife didn't notice. Sound isn't great. The camera doesn't have the best microphone to pick up audio. And there's no built-in image stabilizer, so your picture is only as steady as the hands that shot it. We were only doing a few meters away from one another, and you'd notice the shakiness in the picture. Now for the big question. Is the Ultra HD good enough for the Dieters to toss away their more expensive standard definition camcorder? I really honestly think that I would use it more to complement and keep have it like the, the video on the go, as opposed to using it all the time as my one and only video camera. And that's what this camera is designed for. It's for the YouTube generation, the family on the go, for people that like to capture all of life's little moments, even if they don't have a bigger, bulkier camcorder on hand. All right, a few things you one wanted to talk one. about as we watched some video you shot here this morning. No, the picture actually is really good, but it's Tom. I'm disappointed that the zoom isn't, it's actually optical, or sorry, it's a digital zoom, not optical zoom. Okay. Uh, and I'm disappointed because a, a di digital, or sorry, optical zoom is better. Okay. It means the lens is actually moving, whereas digital, it just, it doesn't actually move. This so is the first version, though. That might be finessed. It is, but it's the size. They can't do mm -hmm. a optical zoom in this. Uh, and it is shaky because any little quiver in your hand shows up in the video. So, it, you know, you have to be careful. There is a spot on the bottom for a tripod, which you do need if you want really clean, crisp video. Price, Mike? Price, $250. And this guy is a little bit smaller, $280, both in Not stores bad. today. Not bad for a price for what you're getting out mm -hmm. of it. Uh, now, the Dieter family, or Dieter's family, who helped us out, we're actually going to give them 
the Ultra oh, HD awesome. for helping us out. But this guy, the Mino HD, is up for grabs. We're going to give this away to a viewer this morning. Okay, so there you go. BTCalgary.ca. You're clicking on Mike Yanni's blog. And what do we want them to ask? We want them to tell us why they need a HD portable camcorder. Okay, give us your spin and let us know why you need this little guy. Uh, we love them, hey? They're great. They Overall, are really pretty handy. wonderful. Pretty good. A lot of families will love this for their summer vacations, I think. Ideal. Great stuff. Thank you, Mike. You're welcome. We're going to take a break here in BT.